before the tomb of uh, Tutankhamun was found, we know nothing about this king. We thought before, uh, as Egyptologists, that he is the brother of Akhenaten. But now the study of the Amarna period and the study of Akhenaten's life and the study uh, of the reliefs really can show that he cannot be the uh, son of Amenhotep III. He is actually born in Amarna. And this is why we believe now that his mother could be Kia. Now we have evidence that she was an Egyptian and she died when she was delivering him as a child. Based on the CT scan that I did, when I took the CT scan, I examined the mummy of King Tut, we found out that he died in the age of 19. Everyone thought that King Tut was murdered, but because of a hole that they found in the back of the head. Now we are sure now that that hole was not done by the uh, Howard Carter, or it was really a sign of murder. It is a hole that they open in Dynasty 18 when they do mummification. Then for the first time we found there is a fracture in his left leg. This fracture was not from uh, Howard Carter, you know, because Howard Carter, when he found the mummy, the mummy was covered with uh, the golden mask yes. and over 100 pieces of gold. Yes. Then he began to take the mask out, he couldn't. He had to damage the mummy. He damaged the mummy to 18 pieces. And this is why many people could think that this fracture could happen because of that damage yes. that Howard Carter did. But radiologists found that's not true. Found that this fracture is an accident that happened to Tutan Khamun one day before he died. Tutan Khamun used the desert of Memphis for hunting, for jumping, and that he could, number one, die while he was hunting in the desert. Or the second thing, maybe in a war. Maybe he was participating in a war and he died. But at least we can know now the cause of his death for the first time.